Okay guys, welcome to part 3 of the AK-47 tutorial. Now before we move on, we have got some issues to deal with. Go to your face mode. And as you can see here. Right. Go to shaded. We've got a face inside the face. Well it's not really inside the face, but we don't need it so we can delete it. Make sure no one else, nowhere else is selected. Okay. Delete. And then over here, we've got to extrude these two. And these two so to do this okay go into your side view by clicking enter right, enter and now select these two faces here now if yours is only selecting one side yeah go into your move tool double click it and if this is on if we drag and select it'll only select one side okay so make sure it's switched off right drag and select now we're going to extrude and pull it over the edge right okay so now we've done that we're gonna have some faces inside faces which you can see here and if you drag them up and down you can see okay so we've got delete these delete and we've got a verge merge these vertexes together okay let's go to merge click G or merge G G G G. make sure you're dragging to select okay not just clicking so it won't merge it now you'll see a bit of a color difference here and this is because some of the edge around here i think this one is smoother than the rest of the ak-47 or the body of it so we've got harden the edge there we go it's back to normal so now we're going to create the handle of the ak-47 so i'll click the cube and drag it up to about here on the AK-47 and I just want you to scale it in X just a bit to about X we'll say 0.5 no 2 yeah okay scale X 2 okay then pull it down line up the vertexes to the wooden part of it is here and these bits can okay we'll try a different way of modeling okay we'll pull this right to the end pull this right to the end as well some people model like this and I don't really like it now go to insert edge loop I want you to drag it here and I want you to get the vertex and I want you to pull this out about here and here just making the shape of the AK-47's handle now we need it about here and here pull this one in pull this one in it doesn't have to be the bang on the shape but just make it look like it about here and up here and drag this down across there add another one here and pull this vertex out and then pull these out here as well now go to face mode select the top part of it select and go to extrude I want you to click scale ok or if you want, if my my undoes, which it isn't doing, you scale it, okay, so you want to scale it about here, and click G again, and pull it up into the AK-47, and just rotate it a bit, okay, now just one minute, windows, same preferences, preferences, undo, it's on but it ain't working, hmm, Okay. Go ahead and save it and delete your history. And now we're gonna get working on this top part. Okay, so now click the cube. I'm sorry guys if I make a problem I'm gonna have to restart the recording again because my undo button don't work. So let me just try it one more time. Preferences undo. Turn it off. On. Delete this. Nope, don't 
doesn't work. Okay. So I drag the box up. Well, the cube. And then you want it about. Let's say 2.3 in X. Okay. Well. 2.5. Yeah, make it 2.5 in X. And then put it about here. Grab a vertexes and pull these out to about here. I we'll just want it there, okay? And then pull these ones back here. And then go to face. Select this back face. Click extrude. We're going to pull it out. So a minute. Go to edge. Select the edge. Pull it right to the end. Grab this vertex. Pull it down. Go back to face. Extrude again. Go back to vertex. Pull it down again. Face. G. Then I want you to pull it down again. Okay, now these bottom vertexes bring them up a bit to about here and go to face, delete all the faces at the bottom. Okay, um, what else? If we smooth it, maybe just add an edge loop across the top of it. Okay, about here. And what we can do then is grab these vertexes up at top. Grab these ones here. Yeah, and then just scale them in and just lift them up a bit. Okay, and now when you add in your guiding edges like this and stuff, it'll look a lot better. Okay, so just oh, I can't undo, can I? Can I just delete this edge? And that's it until part four comes. Alright, cheers guys.